Kate receives her first royal gong, from tiny South Pacific Island Tuvalu. The Duchess of Cambridge has received an award for the very first time from the South Pacific Island nation of Tuvalu. Kate and her husband William received the Tuvalu Order of Merit in recognition of their 2012 visit to the Polynesian nation of nine tiny islands with a combined population of 11,200 spread over 10 square miles. But as the Duchess is expecting her third child, she did not travel the 10,000 miles to made a member of the Tuvalu Order of Merit in person. Instead the couple were honoured five years later after their visit during a private ceremony at Kensington Palace by Tuvalu's honorary consul in London, Dr. Rifta Kare Iats. Their visit there as part of a tour of Asia and the Pacific marking the Queen's Diamond Jubilee in 2012 produced iconic images of the royal couple. They were carried off their charter aircraft shoulder high on a spectacular double throne by 25 Polynesian men dressed in pandanus leaf skirts. Later, crowned with flower garlands and wearing brightly colored skirts swinging from their hips, the couple danced the night away with islanders in paradise. At the time of announcing their award, Dr. A. Iats said, Whenever they have been reminded about it, they have expressed great affection and love for the country. They had a lovely time there. They will remember that visit for a very long time. The Order of Merit is the country's highest award and forms part of a new honours system set up to be independent from Britain's twice yearly awards, which previously included people honoured in Tuvalu one of the fifteen overseas realms where the Queen is head of state. The Queen officially approved the awards for his grandson and wife Kate. Tuvalu, a palm-fringed former British colony known as the Elias Islands until it became a fully independent nation in 1978, is the third smallest country in the world in terms of population and the fourth smallest in land size. Made up of five coral atolls and four islands rising from the sea but no higher than 15 feet halfway between Australia and Hawaii, it is vulnerable to climate change and higher sea levels. Kensington Palace confirmed the couple were honoured to receive the awards. In a speech during their 2012 visit, Prince William said, Your wonderful welcome has to be the most original and quite literally uplifting ever. We will both remember it and the joy and happiness of what has followed for the rest of our lives, our lives.